So I watched that last night. I mean, my husband both went oh! <laughs> like this because it was the first time you'd seen it, and it was yeah. a flirty date. And when you take that with everything else that's been going on, mm. it must have been quite difficult for you to see that. Yeah, it's kind of brought everything back up to me. Like obviously yeah. what I dealt with for the like, last two weeks. So because your body language towards Jess at that point, you it was almost mm. like she was trying to look get your eye, and you you almost couldn't look at her. <laughs> you sunk into your seat like. <laughs> yeah, she was, she was trying to reassure me, but obviously I was just a bit I was a bit annoyed at this. So situation. did you fit you feel a very different way within the length of that VT the moment they introduced it you were feeling you were a happy bunny you came out of it you felt differently for for a minuscule like I'm out of time because obviously it, I'd never seen a date and I'd never I'd never knew what had gone on in the date so yeah. I'd, even when I got out I'd never seen I've not been able to watch anything back so and did you talk to her about that after the show did you yeah, say yeah, uh, when we, when and what we, did she say how yeah, did she we explain that one she just said it's just how it is it's uh, obviously you go on dates and you, you need to flirt you need to have a good time on a date so it was only a bit And they're floating for the telly. You can't yeah, go yeah, out and yeah. have a dull date if you're on the telly, yeah. can you? <laughs> well, I, well, I had a dull date with Tyler, didn't I? So. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah. That is actually yeah, true. Yeah. Yeah. Um, um, so I think, I think uh, obviously, the, the, the way this has worked out for anyone who's, who's mm. watching the show, um, it's whether or not there is a future for you guys. Having a relationship and saying you love her, she's mm -hmm. the one, yeah. when you're in, in the villa is one thing. When you yeah. get into the outside world, it's entirely different. So how is it going? How do you feel? It's going better than ever, you know. Um, obviously, I feel like we've been in the villa, you, you, there's only so much you can accomplish, and I feel like we did it all, other than being official in the villa. Um, so now we've come out, it's just, we are, obviously, we are official, and it's... I see where yeah, it goes. Yeah, it's going amazing. And I looked down, at the, looking through all the things as I follow you all, and, and, and I saw a picture of her with a, a ring on her finger. I saw this. <laughs> yeah. is this, is this. Did you give her this ring? No, it, is she, are you now engaged? <laughs> Here it is. I mean, that's... That, when you put a, walk out with a, with a diamond yeah. ring on your wedding band and you've just come out of the Love Island Villa... Yeah, if she actually had it on in the villa. She's that last. She wears that ring all the time. I was going to say, yeah, please yeah. tell me it wasn't Mike that gave it to her. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I'd have something to say about that. <laughs> have you spoken about marriage? Um, we spoke about it. Obviously, you speak about everything in the villa and yeah. what you plan. What about out. afterwards? We've not really spoke about it since we've been out. Obviously, we know it, that is the natural progression. Obviously, not right this not Take right this minute, me. but obviously in time, yeah. And what does she think about taking it that step, that serious step? She's she's all ready to go. Is she? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have we got the VT? Here we go. Have, I just, just this, we asked her that question. I think this is her reaction. Jess. It's not that one. It's not that one. Well done, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. He apparently has uh, said to the son, if it carries on like that outside the villa, then I do see myself proposing. Oh, bless him. It's a bit... I mean, let's not jump the gun on any of this. <laughs> but no, I adore the boy and I can't wait to see him. Let's not jump yeah. the gun. That's basically what I just said, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Go on. No, I was going to say, obviously, now we've been out, obviously things, things have changed because mm. she didn't know how we was going to progress on the outside. Yeah, but, yeah, sure. Yeah. Do you think that now it would just be nice to kind of step away from the cameras, step away from all the questioning and just give yeah. this relationship a real run? Because what would you say? Because you've done this, you know, yeah. you came out there, you had all the spotlight turned on you, you're now engaged, so... See it all before yeah. my eyes! <laughs> so what would your advice be? Because the, the winners of Love Island last year, it, it didn't work out for them. Yeah, I think you do just have to, I, know I say take your time, I mean, we waited six months, it's not really a long time, but it is when you know, you know, it's just you do have to step away, you do have to take time for yourself, go on a nice holiday together, be alone together, have no cameras, and just see how things go, never jump the gun, mm. but if you feel it's right, sometimes it just mm. is. Mm. You, uh, you've been able to do a little bit of normal dating, haven't you, without the cameras, have you, have you done any of that? Uh, I wouldn't call it normal dating, no, because everyone comes up to you while you're eating <laughs> food and stuff like that, so... Right. It's, it's not, nothing's normal anymore, but it's, uh, that's what we signed up for, isn't it? So. And, and, but it would be nice, as you say. It's nice to go yeah. to the supermarket, go to the pictures, you know, so something yeah. like that. You know. As soon as we get a minute, we're going to go, gonna yeah. go away. So. I bet yeah. you are. Mm. Um, what, what about Chris and Olivia? Are they going to be able to get through this? I don't know. I, I love Chris and I love living. I feel like they're the most... If anyone's in there is the most compatible, it's them too. It's just because they, they've got the same temperament and mm. I think on the outside it'll just be a lot easier because it's so a intense. He's softer, though, than yeah. her, maybe. I think she's a lot tighter, even though they're similar. Yeah, she likes to push people away when she gets close to them, though, but on the outside, she won't, I don't think it that happen. I think it's because you're in that intense environment, mm. like things just clash and get exploded. Do you still... think uh, he's going to win it? 
I'd like Chris and Liv to win it, but I think Montana's going to win it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 The public yeah. seems to love her. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they do. They do. It's true. Thank you. Good luck. I hope it all yeah, works. So we've managed to get a little bit of quiet time and uh, away from Fingers the grill, crossed. and it'll be yeah. nice. <laughs> Thank, Thanks, you, Thank, Thank you, Thank you.